Leonardo da Vinci, His Life and Art Introduction Leonardo da Vinci, a Renaissance artist, inventor, and scientist, is often considered to be the most brilliant and versatile geniuses in human history. Born in Italy in 1452, Leonardo excelled in a wide range of fields, painting, sculpture, architecture, engineering, anatomy, and more. He is also known for his scientific studies and inventions, such as flying machines and military weapons. This short essay on Leonardo da Vinci contains basic facts of the artist's biography, explains the importance of his inventions, and analyzes Leonardo's art style. Leonardo da Vinci's Biography Leonardo da Vinci was a great Italian sculptor, artist, painter, and mathematician. Many historians consider Leonardo as one of the most talented and intelligent men who ever lived. Leonardo was born on April 15, 1452. He was born in Vinci, Italy. Leonardo's father and his stepmother took care of him as a child. By the age of 14, Leonardo was working with a famous Italian artist named Verrocchio. Leonardo gained new technical skills such as painting, sculpturing, and metalworking. The artist had already established his workshop at the age of 20. Leonard painted some of his masterpieces between 1480 and 1500. The artist continued to create new works of art from 1500. He painted the Last Supper during this time. The artist also painted the Mona Lisa between 1503 and 1507. This painting was a privately commissioned piece of work. According to many historians, Leonardo considered every aspect of art to produce the best works. Leonardo da Vinci also contributed a lot to the Renaissance period of art. Leonardo da Vinci's Art Style Leonardo da Vinci's style of art was the High Italian Renaissance. This style of art occurred in Italy from 1490 to 1527. The style of art presented new ideas and qualities. Every artist during the period produced exceptional artistic qualities. The style portrayed a great change in European culture. The proponents of the High Renaissance style wanted to attack the political and religious tensions encountered in Europe during the period. The tension influenced many sculptors and painters throughout Europe and Italy. Most of the painters in this style wanted to portray beauty and harmony. The style ensured every piece of art was perfect. Humanism also became a common practice because every artist wanted to glorify man. Most of the Renaissance painters and sculptors produced pieces of art that glorified human beings instead of God. Many religious paintings such as The Last Supper glorified man. Michelangelo was the master of Italian oil painting. Michelangelo produced some great works of art such as Sistine Chapel Ceiling. The other Renaissance artist was Raphael. Raphael produced some famous paintings such as Sistine Madonna and Transfiguration. Donato Bramante was also a famous High Renaissance painter. Leonardo da Vinci, Personal Reflection I have gained new ideas from the life of this artist. Leonardo was a genius because he explored new concepts and ideas in art. He worked hard to achieve his goals as a great Italian artist. I have understood how to think widely and critically to achieve my goals. My favorite artwork from Leonardo is The Last Supper. This painting combines every aspect of good artwork. The artwork also portrays every quality of a powerful piece of art. I already knew much about Leonardo da Vinci as a great painter before undertaking this exercise. I have used this knowledge to explore everything about Leonardo's life and artworks. The artistic style I like the best is the High Italian Renaissance. The style marked a new beginning in the world of art. I am planning to read more books and articles to understand this period of art much better. I will also explore other styles of art such as Impressionism, Cubism, and Surrealism. Such styles played a critical role in reshaping the world of art. 